in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to make a miniature acrylic paint pack. I'm taking a straw and I cut one inch of it. Next I'm taking aluminum foil and I'm cutting a piece that is approximately three inches on two inches wide. I'm placing a straw nearly at the top of the strip and I start rolling the foil around the straw and I shape a tube. Flatten the long tail of the aluminum foil and on the other end you have these tiny edges just insert the foil into the straw. At the end where you have the flat tail, you should fold the aluminum foil a couple of times. Now you can take a piece of white paper and a glue stick. I chose to use this white sticky paper. I cut out a small rectangle. I decided to, roll, to write on it uh, acrylic and I glue it on the top of the tube. And each tube I painted with uh, acrylic paint. For the cap I decided to use a small glue stick but you can use beads or even uh, roll a piece of paper. I have it on a needle because it's uh, just much more comfortable to paint and uh, I'm painting them with um, red nail polish. Then I'm gluing the cap to the tube using the hot glue. Next step I'm taking clear plastic. I need a thin strip of it and I will fold it according to the size of the tube. I fold it once, flip over, leave a couple of millimeters, fold again. Flip over, again leave a couple of uh, millimeters and fold and that's the outcome and each partition will hold one tube and it will keep them all in place. So I continue until I have um, about uh, six partitions. I'm now making the plastic case, that's why I took 
this plastic sheet protector I cut out a strip that is slightly longer than the clear plastic. I fold the front of it to the height of the tube so the front part is uh, shorter. In addition I need a thin strip Now I'm placing on one ruler the case and on the top of it the piece of clear plastic, the strip. I cover it with another ruler. I leave outside about 2 millimeters, and then I melt them on a candle. So I have melted one side, now I will flip it over and um, seal the other side. And this uh, little plastic strip should be on the outer side of the case, at the front. I cover it with uh, two rulers, leave outside a couple of millimeters and melt it. I fold it and remove the excess of clear plastic at the front so I can close it properly. One more thing, I want to fix this clear plastic inside the case. That's why I'm taking a piece of um, cardstock I'm cutting out a rectangle that will fit inside the case and using the hot glue I'm gluing together the clear plastic that we have just folded to the piece of cardboard or the cardstock and now they all fit together. 